In Corpus Christi, Texas, a bank contractor accidentally locked himself inside of an ATM and kept slipping notes to customers begging for help. Welcome back to What's Trending, I'm Ava Gordy. I want to thank this unnamed man for giving me a phobia that I never knew I had, getting trapped in an ATM. Although I don't see any reason why I would ever get trapped in an ATM. So, I think I'm golden. The contractor was stuck inside of a small antechamber room between the ATM outside and the bank's interior. He was refilling the machine when he locked the door behind him. What an idiot! No, that was mean. That was harsh. The man said that he was screaming for help, but the room is apparently soundproof, so didn't work. This all occurred around 2 p.m. on a Wednesday when the bank was definitely open. When he realized customers were retrieving cash from the machine, he passed notes to them through the ATM receipt slot. One read, please help, I'm stuck in here and I don't have my phone. Please call my boss. Me personally, if I was stuck in an ATM, I wouldn't want you to call my boss, I'd want you to call my mommy. I mean, what would you do in this situation? You're casually using the ATM and suddenly the ATM gives you a note that says, please help, instead of all the money you wanted. I'd be pissed. Some customers appear to dismiss the notes as a gag, but somebody finally called the police. Officers heard a faint voice coming from inside the ATM, hey, I thought it was soundproof, and kicked in the door to the room to free the man. They had to kick in the door? They couldn't get anybody at the bank to unlock it? That seems extreme. Personally, it sounds terrible to get stuck in a tiny ass room for so long, but some people don't agree. At Outmouth tweets, damn fake news, he was stuck in the room that held the ATM and not inside the machine itself like a Doctor Who episode. That's true. This is very misleading. He wasn't stuck inside of the ATM itself, okay? This is different. If you don't think getting stuck in a small room is a big deal, consider what happened to Nicholas White. Nicholas took a smoke break while working late and ended up stuck in an elevator in the McGraw Hill building in New York City for 41 hours. So guys, tell us, have you ever been trapped in a small room? Let us know in the comments below, like this video, and subscribe for more What's Trending.